This process is crucial when you're migrating your hard disk to an SSD. Watch the complete video to learn how to clone your hard disk step by step. Don't miss it. Stay with SetNFix. If you're planning to clone your operating system from your current hard disk to a new SSD, there's one essential tool you need, and that's Minitool Partition Wizard. This powerful software makes the entire cloning process simple and efficient, even for beginners. To get started, head over to their official website at www.partitionwizard.com. From there, you can download the free version of the software. Don't worry, the free version has everything you need to successfully clone your operating system and data to your new SSD. Once the download is complete, open the installer and follow the simple steps to install the software on your computer. The installation process is straightforward and doesn't require any advanced setup. Just make sure you allow the software to run with administrative permissions when prompted. Now let's take a look at the SSD I'll be using to clone the operating system. This is a SATA SSD from NetTac, a brand known for producing reliable and affordable storage devices. The SSD comes with 240 gigabytes of storage, which is more than enough for most operating systems, along with essential files and applications. Before we begin the cloning process, I'm going to unbox this SSD. It comes securely packed to protect it from any physical damage during shipping. As you can see, the form factor is slim and compact, perfect for laptops or desktop PCs that support SATA drives. If you're planning to upgrade from an older mechanical hard drive to an SSD like this, you'll instantly notice major improvements. I'm using a portable hard disk converter box to connect the SSD with my laptop. Then you can use this USB 3.0 cable to connect the SSD drive. Once your SSD is connected to the laptop, it's time to begin the cloning process. Launch the Mini Tool Partition Wizard software. On the main screen, you'll see an option labeled Migrate OS to SSD. Click on it to continue. Now you'll be presented with two choices. Option A lets you copy the entire hard disk, including all data and partitions. Option B copies only the operating system, which is ideal if you want a fresh start. Choose the option that best suits your needs. Next, select the source drive. This is the hard disk you want to clone. Then choose the destination drive, which is your newly connected SSD. Click apply to start the migration. The process may take a few minutes depending on the size of your data, so be patient. Once the migration is complete, it's time to physically swap the drives. Carefully open your laptop, remove the existing hard drive, and install the new SSD in its place.
now power on the laptop. If everything was done correctly, your system will boot from the SSD faster and smoother than ever. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Be innovative and stay with Set and Fix.